Hi, dear brothers and sisters in Christ from around the world. I would like to share some passages with you from one of my favorite books. No, it's not the Bible, but it's about the end times. Now, first of what you must know. We are to be busy working, serving, and witnessing. We are to live righteously. We are to minister to others until he comes. We are to advance the kingdom. We are to win souls for Jesus. You and I have the good news of salvation. Let's not keep it to ourselves. Let's share it with others and win as many souls as possible to eternal life in Christ. Now this is uh, So, this is what I want to tell you. Imagine there are three lesser devils, and then there's the devil, which is the old devil. Three are apprentices of his. The first apprentice demon said, I will whisper to them, there is no God. I will conquer them by turning them into atheists. This is how they're trying to deceive the people around the world. The old devil said, Fool, that approach almost never works. Even the atheist in the secret chambers of his own soul knows there is a God. The second apprentice demon said, I will whisper to them, there is no hell. I will conquer them by convincing them they need not fear the final judgment. The old devil said, Fool, that approach won't work. They may try to deceive themselves. But their conscience testifies that there is right and there is wrong. There is heaven and there is hell. The third apprentice demon said, I will whisper to them, there is plenty of time to repent and believe. Why hurry? The old devil said, correct. That is how you will conquer them. Go out, my apprentice, and ruin eternity for millions of human beings. If you think you have plenty of time to get right with God, if you think you'll have many opportunities to commit your life to Jesus Christ, if you think there's no reason to hurry, you have bought into Satan's lie. Your most precious possession, your soul, the eternal soul, is in great danger. I urge you, I beg you, do not make this mistake. Do not let the satanic strategy ruin your entire eternity. Today, at this very moment, might be the only opportunity you'll have. It may not come again. Say yes to Jesus. Receive the gift of eternal life while there is still time. This is what we must do. Ask God into your heart and your life. Surrender your life fully over to God. Believe in Jesus Christ. And if you have not turned to him yet, turn to him today. And repent of all of your sins because we don't know what tomorrow brings. Today is here, but tomorrow is not promised. So we must repent, believe, and receive Jesus. Open the door to your heart to him. Surrender your life to him while there is still time So just think if Jesus came today and you were face to face with him Would you really go to heaven? Are you really ready? Because we must all at Every moment be ready for Christ being watchful Yes, we must watch for that and eternity is forever. We got to think, where do we want to end up? Are you rapture ready?